This is Raymond Soler. Let me ask you a question. What do you do when one of your favorite television programs is canceled? It's happened to me, and it may have just happened to you. The following article is from the May 22nd, 2023 issue of TV Guide. It was a twist that no one saw coming. Paramount Network announced that Yellowstone, its popular drama about the rich Dutton clan of cattle ranchers, led by the stern patriarch and Oscar-winning Kevin Costner, would be canceled. Can I say it isn't so, Ray? This show will end after the second half of its fifth season. And not since The Walking Dead has the biggest show on TV been one airing on basic cable, especially in the age of streaming. But throughout its run, Yellowstone has managed to come out on top in the ratings while airing against stalwart broadcast staples, which is no small feat for a Western today. John Wayne is gone. Kevin Costner will still be here. That's good news for Kevin. <laughs> I'm his doctor and I know. <laughs> to the millions of viewers who have made Yellowstone one of the most successful series in recent years, the end comes as a surprise. But in reality, the writing has been on the wall for some time. The saga's future began to look questionable when Costner, who received a Golden Globe for his work last January, but didn't attend the ceremony due to severe weather, instead recorded an Instagram video without acknowledging the show or production team, though he did make a post thanking them the night of the awards. In early February, talk began to build around the campfire regarding tension between Costner and the creator of Yellowstone, Taylor Sheridan, with reports that the pair were butting heads about scheduling. The actor wanted to spend fewer hours on set because he had a new project lined up, the four-part Horizon film series. Then came news that a still untitled sequel from Sheridan was slated to premiere in December, not starring Cosner, but another Hollywood superstar, Texas native Matthew McConaughey. With most of the current cast involved, an executive producer, David Glasser, described this series as picking up where Yellowstone leaves off in another epic tale. Immediately, more rumors began to circulate. In April, Costner fueled fresh speculation when along with Sheridan and other cast members, he unexpectedly canceled his appearance at Paley Fest. 
That was followed by the news that his longtime wife, Christine, had filed for divorce, according to People magazine, due to his demanding work schedule. Yellowstone was set to return in November, but as of early May, it hadn't started filming its final episodes. At least we have some time to mourn before it gets dropped off at the train station, the place where they dump bodies. <laughs> Settle up! This is Ray. TV or not TV? That is the question. It's impossible for the viewing audience to really know the inner workings behind the scenes that show people go through. I confess I've never watched even one episode of this Western. Kevin Costner still remains one of my favorite actors, but so does Matthew McConaughey. Personally, get ready for this. George and I love watching reruns of what I think was the funniest television show ever. Reba. <laughs> Are you shocked? <laughs>